you can start to play. Welcome back to race day here on Kids Toys Play. Stefano the Super Cruiser getting ready to give out a Thomas and Friends Minis blind bag. Let's meet the contestants. Celebration Thomas. Celebration Nia. Lorenzo. Raul. Hyperglow Ashima. Gina. Young Bao. Celebration Percy. Charlie. Golden Thomas. Luke. Rebecca. Armored Thomas. Hyperglow Percy. Fireworks Hyperglow Thomas. And introducing a new contestant, here is Gustavo. Gustavo meeting Thomas on his big world, big adventure. Another big number four engine with a double decker cargo van. Wow. First impression, Liam, what do you think of this guy? Um, I like his face. He's got an, you like his face? Mm -hmm. Good looking guy. Looks like a big diesel cab. He's got the double decker passenger car and he's pulling some cargo. What is that? Sugar cane. Oh, he's pulling some sugar cane. Good stuff. Gustavo, he looks like he might go fast. Let's see if he can race. Gustavo looking good. His passengers seem happy, mostly because they're hopped up on sugar cane. And he has absolutely no problem staying on track in all occasions, folks. But let's get back to racing. First up, it is Rebecca of the Northwestern Railway up against Gustavo, who looks very confident, and he should be. He just arrived. On your marks, get set, go! Here they go and look at this Gustavo on the rainbow track and he is very powerful. He is well ahead of Rebecca as he takes the high road, goes up, it looks like he might get derailed here but our passenger, or helper rather, quick to help him out. Rebecca in a distant second as they come back over that hill and look at Gustavo fly right back Stefano. And into the winner's circle, folks. Stefano likes Gustavo and says goodbye to Rebecca Vo. Next up, it's the little shunter from Brazil, Raul, going up against Charlie, who's always laughing at people. On your marks, get set, go! And here we go, off to the races. It looks like Raul, the little Brazilian. Wow, is he ever going fast on this rainbow track, folks? And he's got the high road coming up, and he's going around. Well ahead of Charlie at this point. I don't think there is any catching Raul, who has those beautiful Brazilian colors and makes it to the finish line. Raul is no fool, and he makes it on to the second round. Another international race as Celebration Nia, all the way from Kenya, takes on Young Bao of China. On your marks, get set, go! Wow, we Young Bao of China, he has a tiger chasing him and he is absolutely no match for Nia. Will there be a malfunction at the junction? Oh, look at that, oh wow! Young Bao of China has knocked off Nia because he was too slow, but it doesn't matter. Young Bao now having a problem climbing the hill, but Nia gets the fireworks and the win. Celebration Nia has a lot to celebrate here as she has eliminated Young Bao. Lorenzo, the musical engine from Italy up against Hyper Glow Percy who has a lot of bright colors. I really like this guy actually. He does well on this track. This is his native track, this Hyper Glow. On your marks, get set, go! And here we go, Lorenzo gets a little bit of a lead. Hyper Glow Percy going down the track but Lorenzo is going down the track and that's what matters in a race, folks. It looks like Percy gets that inside track and he will come out slightly ahead. Will Lorenzo be able to pass him, let alone catch him? I think he will. Percy coming in very quickly. This is going to be up to the judges and look at that. Wow. A very close race, but finally an engine from Sodor makes it onto the second round. Lorenzo has been eliminated. Next race, best friends collide as Armor Thomas looking good in his helmet up against Celebration Percy, who just looks good all the time. On your marks. Get set. Go. And here they are in Celebration Percy, slightly ahead, but Armour Thomas coming down strong. Interesting to see who's gonna get the inside track. They might have the advantage here, very close race. Oh no, Celebration Percy got caught up, which gives Armour Thomas a huge advantage. Coming over the hill, it looks like he is in shock. That helmet of his goes through and doesn't get caught this time, wow. A very close and fun race, and it looks like 
Celebration Percy got caught up on the track giving Armor Thomas an advantage. Next up, let's have Hyperglow Ashima on her Hyperglow track going up against Golden Thomas who is just in party mode for the entire year because it's his birthday. On your marks, get set, go! And here we go and it looks like Ashima slightly ahead of Golden Thomas coming up over the hill. And this Hyperglow track with that Hyperglow line, she has the outside track. Thomas on the inside, I think he will come out first. And he is slightly ahead at this point, folks, but it looks like Ashima is coming out strong and she has gone over the mound first. Definitely ahead at this point and she will go on. Get the fireworks, hooray! Hyperglow Ashima putting on her Hyperglow engine has eliminated Golden Thomas who is still partying. Next up, our last international engine, it is Gina of Italy going up against Celebration Thomas who is nice and light. Let's how he, see how he runs. On your marks, get set, <laughs> go! And here we are, look at these two going. It looks like Gina might have a little bit of an advantage, but Celebration Thomas coming on strong. Oh, Celebration Thomas, his front wheels are off. And look at that, folks. Gina, oh, barely has a malfunction at the junction. She is coming over the hill. She is very, very focused, as a shunter should be, and she has got the win. Wow, these Celebration engines don't have much to celebrate. They keep getting eliminated. Congratulations, Gina. Final race of the first round has fireworks. Hyperglow Thomas going up against Remote Control Luke who is hard, we don't even know if he's coming or going or if he's here or there. On your marks, get set, go! And here we go and it looks like Fireworks might be in his boiler as he is taking a big leap over Luke. He will get the inside track giving him a bit of an advantage. Luke getting a little bit slow on the outside but here comes Fireworks Thomas with his Hyperglow running on the Hyperglow track, doing very well. He goes on and he has won. Congratulations, Thomas. You have eliminated Luke, who will go back to the Blue Mountain Quarry and probably hide himself. Stefano the Supercruiser loving what he sees so far, folks. As eight trains remain here in the second round, Armor Thomas, Celebration Nia, Gina, Gustavo, Raul, Hyperglow Ashima, Hyperglow Percy, and Hyperglow Thomas. First competition, let's have Armor Thomas go up against Celebration Nia. On your marks, get set, go! Oh, looks like it, Armor Thomas rather had a little bit of a head start, but here's Celebration Nia, she's coming out strong, and she definitely has a little bit of a lead, but this is how Armor Thomas eliminated Celebration Percy, I believe. But look at Nia, she is definitely in the lead, even though she took the outside track, and she is going up over the hill. Look at her go, folks, right past Stefano and gets the win. Armor Thomas has been eliminated from the little orange engine from Kenya. Next up, it is Gina of Italy going up against Gustavo. On your marks, get set, go! And here we have Gustavo taking over Gina, going up. What a fast race these two engines are doing. Oh wow, Gustavo's got the inside track. And he has definitely passed Gina at this point. He is rumbling down the line like number four, another number four engine we know, who also goes super fast. I'm talking about Gordon, but it's Gustavo's day today. Gustavo working hard to make a first impression here on Kids Toys Play, has eliminated Gina and goes on to the final four. And Gina stands on her head. Wow. Next up, let's see if Raul can use that Brazilian magic to take out Ashima or Hyperglow Ashima, even though it's a Hyperglow track. On your marks, get set, go! And here we are, Raul looks like he has a little bit of a lead right off the bat. Ashima coming on strong, who will get the inside track? Oh my goodness, it is Raul. And that means he will definitely get a big lead. You can see Ashima off in the distance as a little Brazilian shunter. Actually, these engines are both shunters, and it looks like Raul won. Well, they first met in the great race, and we always wondered who the better shunter is, and now we know, it's Raul. Hey, look at this. It is the last race of the second round, and we have Hyperglow Percy and a Hyperglow Thomas. You know what we should do, son? Turn the lights off and let them race. On your marks, get set, glow! And look at the tracks glow, folks. It looks like Percy's slightly ahead. Oh, but he got caught. He got stuck, and here comes Thomas. Glow, glow, Thomas. Thomas, light up the track, and they're going. And look at this. It's now world's strongest engine. Oh, my goodness. That race gets glowing reviews as Hyper Glow Thomas goes on to the next round. Percy, good glowing, my friend. 
Welcome to the final four, folks, with Gustavo, Celebration Nia, Hyperglow Thomas, and Raul. Interesting to note, we've got three international engines and only one Sodor engine. First up, let's have Gustavo, our newest engine, take on Nia. On your marks, get set, go! And here they are, folks, almost neck and neck. Looks like Gustavo is definitely a little bit ahead at this point. Celebration Nia coming out strong. She has the inside track that might give her a slight advantage. Gustavo coming out, and now it is Celebration Nia. Well ahead, Gustavo coming down the line, but look at this, folks, and in the end, oh my goodness, wow! Celebration Nia, one of our newer engines, has taken out our newest engine, Gustavo. Way to go, Nia, you made it to the final. And who will Nia face in the final? Let's find out as Hyperglow Thomas takes on Raul of Brazil. Raul? Yeah. Raul? Raul. 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 Ravioli? <laughs> on your marks, get set, go! Whoosh and a whoosh, and here is Raul. It looks like he is getting slightly ahead of Celebration Thomas, if you will. Or not Celebration Thomas, but Fireworks Thomas. Thomas getting that inside track, but I don't think it's enough. I think Raul is still ahead. Little Brazilian shots are going hard. This is like the great race all over again. And here is Raul, and he goes on, and he gets the fireworks. Wow, and it looks like all the Sonor engines are eliminated. Congratulations, Raul. And it looks like Stefano, the Super Cruiser, has picked out the Thomas and Friends Minis blind bag as we are set to race the final with Celebration Nia and Raul of Brazil. Who will win today's great race competition? On your marks, get set, go! And these two engines racing for the title of the winner of the great race. It looks like Raul definitely ahead at this point. Celebration Nia, oh my goodness, she has the inside track. That will give her an advantage. She's coming out and she's now well ahead of Raul. Raul was doing so good. Celebration Nia, the little Kenya engine, bright orange, member of the steam team, and she goes on and she wins. Raul doing the best he could. If he had the inside track, I think he'd be winning. But the race, the victory, and the Minis blind bag goes to Celebration Nia. Congratulations. Let's see what she gets to celebrate. Oh, look at this. Helping us celebrate 75 years of Thomas and Friends at 75th birthday, Percy. Celebration Nia gets to play with this birthday, Percy. He's got stars in his eyes with the 75 train on the side and on his roof of his cab. They're both 75th editions. They're both 75th editions. Fantastic. And Celebration Nia banging the drum and carrying Percy as she does her victory lap. Lots to celebrate here on Kids Toys Play. Great race competitions. Thanks for joining us, folks. And Raul is being a spoiled sport. Oh, keep going, Nia. Right on, Stefano. I forgot to put the emergency brakes on. Well, the drum even stopped. Way to go, Percy. 